Sometimes I think Christians sort of assume that Jesus claimed to be the Son of God, and we look askance at skeptics and others who say, well, he never really did. But it can be a good thing to go back and review those instances in which he asserted his deity and offered his messianic credentials. In the end, the evidence is compelling, and it's made especially clear by the reaction of his audiences when they declared blasphemy. Of course, it wasn't blasphemy if his divine claims were actually true, and his resurrection shows us that they were. There are a lot of implications for us if Jesus returned from the dead, but none more powerful than what was told by a philosopher who I interviewed. He said, God took the very worst thing that could ever happen in the history of the universe, deicide or the death of God's son on the cross, and he turned it into the very best thing that could ever happen in the history of the universe, which is the opening of heaven for all who follow him. And if God can take the absolute worst thing and turn it into the indisputably best thing, then what problem, what circumstance, what challenge, what weakness, or what mistake in your own life are you convinced that he can't help you overcome?